Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In this lesson, we will discuss applying a style to your document by using the Styles button group within the Home tab of the ribbon, as well as by using the Apply Styles pane. You are able to apply a style before or after you have entered text. If you want to set a style before you type, then choose your style first. You can apply a style to text already in your document by selecting the text to which you want to apply the style first. To apply styles, click the Home tab in the ribbon. In the Styles button group, you will see a list of styles. Scroll through this list using the arrow buttons to the right of the list, or click the More button to fully expand the list. These are the most used styles in Word. If you have text selected in your document, hovering over a Style Choice will show you a preview of the style before you select it. Click on the style of your choice to apply it to the selected text in your document. If you clicked the More button shown in the Styles button group of the Home tab in the ribbon, you will have noticed the Apply Styles command. Choosing this command will open the Apply Styles pane. You will see a Style Name drop-down list as well as three buttons and a checkbox. You can click the drop-down list to view all of the available preset styles. You can also type the name of the style that you want to view into the drop-down list to navigate immediately to that style. You can check or uncheck the autocomplete style names checkbox to turn that function on or off. When you have selected a style from the list, you can then click the Apply or Reapply button to apply it to your selected text within your document. Clicking the Modify button lets you modify a selected style. Clicking the Styles button will open the Styles pane. Modifying styles as well as using the Styles pane will be covered in further lessons within this chapter. Note that the Apply Styles pane will appear floating above the work area. Like all panes within Word, you can dock the pane to the left or right side of the application window or resize it if needed. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.